The spacer is a thick metal washer that fits between the chuck and the chuck spindle. It both provides clearance between the chuck and the gearbox housing and helps prevent the chuck from becoming over tightened on the chuck spindle. The most common reason to replace the spacer is that it becomes lost while replacing the chuck. Replacing the spacer is a repair that you can do yourself and I'm going to show you how. Hi, I'm Mark Soja. Do-it-yourself repairs like these are easier than you might think. From lawn machines to cordless grills, kitchen mixers, outdoor grills, our how-to videos walk you through each repair from start to finish. So doing it yourself means never having to do it alone. Let's get started. I'll begin by removing the chuck from the drill. The chuck is secured with a retaining screw, and the retaining screw has reverse thread. With the retaining screw removed, now I can remove the chuck. I'll clamp a large Allen wrench into the chuck. Next, I'll strike the Allen wrench very quickly with a mallet. The sudden momentum will break the threads free so the chuck can be unscrewed. The chuck is a regular thread. With the chuck removed, now I can remove the spacer. Next, I'll install the new spacer. The spacer fits over the spindle, and with it in place, I can reinstall the chuck. I'll once again use the Allen wrench to tighten the chuck. I'll just give it a light tap with the mallet to secure it. And I'll finish by reinstalling the retaining screw. And remember, it is reverse thread. And that's how easy it is to replace the chuck spacer on your drill. Be sure to check back often for new videos and expert advice. If you found this video helpful, give us a thumbs up and leave a comment.